There were about 100 students from elementary to college that took part in a unique career day program that Thad you were talking about, complete with a DJ and photo booth. For some, it was their first time on a golf course. I play golf at the Boys and Girls Club uh, in Genesee Valley. Not everyone's been playing golf since the age of five, like Ashton Worth, but he and a dozen of kids from the Boys and Girls Club of Rochester, East High, and other organizations are among those treated to a tour of Oak Hill, some lunch, and a special guest appearance today from the Buffalo Bills. In addition to meeting athletes, participants attended several panels and heard about the numerous careers associated with PGA of America. It opens their minds to, hey, I do want to go to school to be an engineer, but I could be a golf club engineer. Like a lot of kids don't think that. So we're able to talk about the different opportunities that are in the golf industry. But for those who don't work in golf or who don't end up in golf, how golf can be pivotal to the to accelerating themselves in their careers. I'm a, I'm a, a perfect testament to that story. You know, here I am you know, 40 years into a, a career in the golf industry because I was introduced to the sport very early on. 15-year-old Malachi Finley is a caddy at Oak Hill as well as a member of the Boys and Girls Club. He's looking forward to earning one of the college scholarships offered by PGA of America. And he, too, is an example of the power of inclusion and identity. Specifically, I liked how the um, Beyond the Green part that was introduced to us was specifically uh, and mostly led by um, other African-American um, people so it's like it's like changing like the narrative and that's part of the story these students walked away with today thanks to the exposure to successful CEO athletes and other professionals who look like them